MVF-5. The MVF-5 is a heavy-duty, multi-mission robotic system for emergency response. It is designed for first responders to carry out tasks in dangerous and life-threatening conditions. The MVF-5 has fire extinguishing capabilities, extended and flexible reach, self-cooling capability, detection capability, and is air, sea, and road transportable. It is equipped with various tools such as a rotational gripper and dozer blade for various operations such as rescue support, hazmat slash CBRN handling, and consequence management of critical infrastructure. It can be transported by air, water, or land and has a command and control system and sensors for detection and measuring of toxic industrial chemicals, oxygen level, explosive gas and temperature. The Multiscope UGV The Multiscope UGV is a multi-mission capable unmanned ground vehicle designed for the commercial and government sector, including fire and rescue operations. It features a hybrid diesel-electric drive, rapid reconfiguration, open architecture, and a robust and reliable design with a low or zero noise signature. The platform can carry a payload of 750 kilograms and has a stable low center of gravity. It can reach speeds of 20 kilometers per hour and has a maximum grade of 60% and maximum side slope of 30%. It can run for up to 15 hours with a diesel engine and electric generator or up to 1.5 hours with a battery pack. The line of sight control range is up to 1.5 kilometers and it is designed for air transportability. The Multiscope rescue systems include fire extinguishing and post-fire extinguishing modules, as well as a hose cartridge and a transport module for critical supplies and equipment. Colossus Colossus is a remote-controlled firefighting robot developed by Shark Robotics. It features a high-pressure water cannon and all-terrain treads, allowing it to support firefighters and first responders in dangerous situations. The robot has a payload capacity of 550 kilograms and can climb stairs, drive over challenging terrain, and be controlled from a distance of 300 meters. Colossus has a modular design and can be easily adapted for different tasks with optional modules such as a smoke extraction fan, manipulation arm, stretcher, motorized bull bar, and equipment basket. It is also waterproof and has low maintenance requirements. The robot is piloted remotely by trained firefighters, who can use a handheld controller, vehicle-mounted control station, or smartphone slash tablet app. The robot can also store GPS position, take pictures, and report a zoomed image on a control touchpad. Colossus is designed to shorten the time to assess the risk of a situation and help keep firefighters safe. It weighs 420 kilograms, measures 1.6 m in height, and has a battery life of 4 hours. Thermite RS-1T3 and RS-3 Firefighter Robot Thermite is a firefighting robot that provides fire suppression, situational awareness, and intelligence gathering to first responders. It is operated by remote belly pack controllers and has a real-time video feed for the operator to maneuver the machine through hazardous terrain. The Thermite RS1 model has a 24 HP diesel engine, can output 1,250 gallons per minute at 200 PSI, has a standoff range of 300 to 500 meters, has high strength construction grade tracks and road wheels, and can provide up to 20 hours of runtime without refueling. The RS1 also has optional attachments such as foam nozzle and scene lighting. The Thermite RS3 model has a higher flow rate of 2,500 gallons per minute, a longer length and width, and a heavier weight, with a 36.8 HP Yenmar engine and 8,000 pounds winch. Smokebot 
Smokebot is a robot designed to assist fire services and rescue units in critical conditions where visibility is limited. It collects data about disaster scenes to improve the safety of rescue operations. The robot is equipped with features such as gas sensors, radar, laser scanner, and thermal camera, making it a unique device compared to others available. Smokebot is able to see through smoke-filled areas and map out the area, acting as the eyes for rescue personnel. The robot also has the ability to detect different gases and assess the risk of gas explosion based on temperature and gas concentration. It is remote controlled by rescue personnel and can navigate autonomously if necessary, with the ability to connect to the internet to maintain contact with its operator. In case of losing contact, the robot can navigate back to the last location with internet connection. The European Consortium led by Ariber University in Sweden intends to use Smokebot for reconnaissance missions in low visibility environments, with real-time transmission of images and data to a human operator outside the building. The robot's high bandwidth gas sensors can detect the type, temperature, and concentration of gases, warning firefighters of potential explosions. Turbine-aided firefighting machine TAF-20 the TAF-20 is a state-of-the-art firefighting robot designed to assist human firefighters in combating fires. It features a turbine that helps to spray water or foam from a distance of 60 meters or blast water from 90 meters away. This capability makes it an effective tool for extinguishing fires in difficult-to-reach areas and reducing the risk to human firefighters. The robot is remote-controlled, which allows it to be operated from up to 500 meters away. This makes it possible to operate the robot in hazardous environments without putting human firefighters at risk. Additionally, the TAF-20 has the ability to clear obstacles such as cars and smoke, making it a valuable asset during bushfires. The TAF-20 promises to enhance the efficiency and safety of firefighting operations. TEC-800 Firefighter Robot The TEC-800 is a highly advanced and versatile remotely operated robot designed specifically to support firefighters in their operations. Its capabilities include fire extinguishing, victim assistance, and logistical support. It is equipped with a diffusing water jet to protect itself from high heat and can carry a heavy payload, making it ideal for use in underground fires, industrial sites, and other high-risk areas. The robot is built with state-of-the-art technology, including shock absorbers, anti-roll bars, and brushless motors, which improve its performance and make it more reliable. It requires no maintenance, making it an ideal tool for firefighting teams. The TEC-800 is also equipped with a monitoring system that allows the operator to track its health status in real time, and a black box that records all its activity for faster remote diagnostics. In terms of performance, the TEC-800 is highly capable, with a top speed of 12 km per hour, an autonomy of 22 km, and a traction of 300 m. It is equipped with a 70 mm water hose and can carry a payload of 800 kg, making it an invaluable asset to firefighting teams in extreme situations where risks of explosion, low visibility, and high temperatures are present. The LUF-60 The LUF-60 is a firefighting robot designed for use in situations where traditional firefighting methods are difficult to implement. It is equipped with a 140 HP diesel engine, a crawler chassis, and a water cannon capable of generating up to 2,400 liters of water per minute with a throwing distance of 60 meters. It also has the capability to switch to foam if necessary, with a throwing distance of 35 meters. The robot has a remote control range of approximately 300 meters and can climb stairs and ramps up to an angle of 30 degrees. Other features include a two-stage centrifugal water pump, a ventilator, and a hydraulic tank. Autonomous Water Cannon Robot and Hose Extension Robot 
Mitsubishi Heavy Industries has developed two firefighting robots, the Water Cannon Robot and the Hose Extension Robot. These robots are designed to work together as part of a larger firefighting robot system, which also includes a reconnaissance and surveillance robot, available in aerial and ground models, and a command system. The system is installed on a dedicated transport vehicle that can be brought directly to the fire scene. The robots are built on modified chassis frames from small farm buggies and are equipped with GPS and laser sensors for autonomous movement. The hose extension robot can lay out up to 300 m of fire hose while the water cannon robot has a nozzle for discharging water or foam at a rate of 4,000 liters per minute at a pressure of 1.0 MPa. The robots have a radiant heat resistant structure and are capable of traveling autonomously to designated positions in a radiant heat environment of 20 kilowatts per square meter. The firefighting robot system was developed through a five-year project led by Japan's Fire and Disaster Management Agency. FireOx FireOx is a versatile firefighting robot designed by Lockheed Martin that can perform a variety of tasks in hazardous environments. It features a 250-gallon water tank and a 1.5 AGE pump that can deliver high-pressure, low-volume water for suppression, trenching, and mop-up operations. The vehicle is equipped with EO-IR cameras for day-slash-night operations and for locating hot spots, and a forestry monitor with wireless control. Additionally, it has a foam system for Class A fire suppression, high-intensity lighting, and a portable generator. FireOx can be operated with a game-style controller, programmed to follow a predetermined course, or follow a person, and it has a 9,000-pound winch for casualty or injury evacuation. The robot is designed for use in wildland fires and hazmat incidents and is self-sufficient with its onboard water tank.